My name is Sam Bresman. I've lived in Tampa, Florida for two years. And I'm the business development coordinator with the Tampa Bay Lightning. And I also have Friedrich's a taxi. I would say that Sam and pretty much everybody with Friedrich's a taxi are some of the greatest athletes you've never heard of. And if Sam had not had FA, he probably would have been one of the greatest athletes that you knew about. When, when I found out my reality that that was not going to happen, I figured that the next best thing was to work in sports um, and just keep that dream alive inside me. There's a sparkle in his eye and, um, and his laugh. The laugh is always contagious and, uh, you know, people are drawn to that. Steve and I talk about riding bikes quite a bit, um, but when he actually comes out and rides with us, I think it's really admirable and um, it's a sign of respect. Well, it's obviously it starts with Sam and you know his, his passion and his fight and his will, and I want to be a part of that. Well, I don't know, I'm not sure what you would call it. Maybe it's bravery or courage, or but just to keep going and to not, to just keep fighting and not, not let it take him over, because he really doesn't. There are days that are tougher than others to get out there and do stuff. Um, but on those tough days, one of my main motivations is um, my man Gavin. We met Sam when he was moving down here to go to USF and hit it off immediately. Like Gavin just gravitated to him. We just we just kind of bonded right away talking about sports and life and all that good stuff. Okay, so you just stand there. I want you to just stand as you can. Just stay there as long as you can. Just fight for it, okay? Fight, fight, fight. Seeing that kid and everything that he goes through at such a young age. I struggle on opening anything, yeah. like opening a water bottle, opening a can. Yeah. Getting dressed is pretty hard too, right? Getting dressed. Yeah. It takes a lot longer than most yeah. people. Putting on socks. Yeah. Putting on socks is hard, hard. for me. Shoes too. Does it scare you that you're gonna be using the wheelchair? Or are you worried about what kids are gonna think? Yeah. Yeah? A but lot. A lot? Yeah. Life can be really sad sometimes. But then you meet people like Sam who show you that life's not that bad. And to always find the good. Do you know what I always say? Even though my body and my arms and my legs don't work as well as I want them to, my smile still works. My laugh still works. Yeah. The way I think still works. Yeah. And most importantly, <laughs> as you know, the things that I feel in my heart still work. Right? Yeah. And that, that, that's, that goes the same with you. Yeah. You know, you know I love you, man. Yeah. yeah. Samuel Bridgman. I think on the top days, it's important to look at the positives and think about the people that are in your corner in your life. I feel like the Tampa community is what keeps us, keeps us going. Like we feel involved in a huge way. And when we walk into the, the ball, it's all familiar faces. It's people that not necessarily have to be involved. They want to be there. They're there being part of something that they believe in. Um, and 
Okay, great. Do that. Do that. I mean, my goal for Friedrichs Ataxia Research is to find a cure. And to do that, we need to continue our goals and pull the community forward so that we can push our research forward. Tampa has really been the focal point of it. And for me personally and for my wife personally, it's, it's been a, an incredible connection and an incredible uh, relationship and we're very proud to be a part of it. Yeah, but it's, it's, it's been working out real well because it's a great community down here. I'm still learning, but no one should feel like they, no one should feel ashamed to ask for help because um, everyone needs help at a certain point. We have a lot of people in our corner that are with us until the end to find yep. a cure for FA and hopefully sooner than later. Yep. Yeah. And that is pretty cool. It is pretty cool. There, there's, yeah. there's nothing's going to stop us from, from uh, moving forward and doing what we want in life, right? Yep. We're going to keep going. Yep. Yep. At the end of the day, I, I don't want to have any regrets.